And we'll be doing that. I don't know if we'll have time for music or not. We'll see. I don't know what else is going to happen. But for now, we're going to the news. Believe it or not. From NPR News in Washington, I'm Ann Taylor. An eight-year-old boy in the northern Virginia town of Vienna is hailed as a hero today after capturing a wild wolf and donating it to the National Zoo. The cat circled the base of the tree, gazing upward, and then decided climbing it was not worth the effort. Scientists say that there's a solid nutritional basis for this. A cat requires more calories to scale a tree than the edible parts of a small bird provide. Fluffy said later that while he may occasionally be lazy, he's certainly not stupid. Steve Inskeep, NPR News. At this point in the morning, Peter's grandfather came out of the farmhouse angry that Peter had left the farm without permission. Peter's grandfather was just doing what any parent of his generation would have done. NPR senior news analyst Daniel Shore. The grandfather was a veteran of open field combat in World War II, and so he knew the meadow was a dangerous place. For example, what if the wolf were to attack? 